ZT's Nubia line has been around for quite some time, but the Nubia X is something a little bit more interesting than its past releases, offering dual displays, a sleek design with a 6.2 inch 1080p LCD on the front, and a 720p AMOLED display on the rear. The phone is powered by Qualcomm Snapdragon 845 processor and can be configured with up to 8 gigs of RAM and 128 gigabytes of storage. Although the design of the phone looks quite sleek, you can tell that the rear is quite a fingerprint magnet. But once the screen turns on, those worries are erased and you can start enjoying the unique feature of having two displays on one phone. Perhaps the most important thing is that Nubia has done an excellent job of allowing you multiple different types of configurations for the secondary display. For example, you can see here that you can use the rear display as secondary buttons while you're gaming. So custom L and R buttons on the rear, which is quite handy. You can also configure how the second screen is initialized. So you can press on the dual fingerprint readers to engage the secondary display and switch. You can also have the screens mirrored or you can have the screens set to multitask, meaning that you'll be able to have two different displays running off of one phone showing different items. The second phone that we'll be checking out from Nubia is the Red Magic Mars. This is a gaming smartphone. It can be configured with up to 10 gigabytes of RAM and 256 gigs of internal storage. Unlike the Nubia X, the Red Magic Mars offers a more aggressive look, something that you would expect from a gaming smartphone, and even comes complete with a configurable LED light strip on the rear. The phone even has a dedicated hardware button meant for gaming. Once you engage this, you'll be launched into the gaming portal where you'll have access to your games. This will also increase performance and also keep the unit cool during long gaming sessions. Best of all, both of these phones are quite affordable, being priced at under $500. Unfortunately, they are not available outside of Asia currently. There are plans to bring the Red Magic Mars to the United States at a later date, and it will be available in Europe shortly. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. Otherwise, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you in the next one.